morning, friends. Giving a little update about my day from my car. Not that I'm running late, it's just thought I'd share the ambience of the police right there and it raining. But I hope you're all doing well. I slept good last night. Surprisingly, my back. But I thought I'd give a little back update, speaking of it. But this morning when I woke up, it was sore. Like, I could barely move. And then when I was getting ready this morning and doing my hair, because I'm one of those people that flip my head upside down to blow dry my hair, which was probably my mistake number one, I felt like I needed to sit down and in the middle of getting ready. And I'm never like that. But yeah, right now I'm in my car and I have my heat, my seat warmer on, the heat on, and it feels great on my back. So that's a little pro tip for you. If you have a sore back, just use your, your little butt warmers in your car. So I'm off to work and I'll catch up with you later. Just got off work heading home and it's still raining here. Yay us. Um, I don't know if you can see, but I got my lunch on me today, which is kind of customary for me. And I'm getting my food on me somehow. So if I didn't get my food on me, did I even eat lunch? Anyways, go home and see what Josh is up to. Oh, it's raining again. Just thought I'd share some of my drive in the rain. Tonight for dinner, we're having chicken nuggets and tots made by our chef, master chef, Josh. Thanks for cooking, babe. You're welcome. So in about three weeks, we're going to go to Gatlinburg on a family vacation, road trip style. Um, Josh suggested we should make a playlist of our favorite songs. I've already put my songs in there because, you know, I'm a plan aheader, I'm an overachiever, you know. Um, I'll actually share those on my Instagram and Dash's Instagram so you can see what, what I listen to. I listen to pretty much everything except classical, but that's not so bad. It makes good dinner music though, I will say. But I'm interested to see what Josh will add to the list and what Allie will add to the list. We told Allie it has to be appropriate music. It can't be anything with any bad words or whatnot. But my best friend is actually there right now and I'm pretty freaking jealous of her. I can't wait to go. It's been a while since I've been, um, probably at least good eight years since I've been. And it'll be the first time we've been as a couple and as a family. So... I'll be interested. I'm not interested. I'm excited to go and I can't wait to share our adventure with you. I'm gonna ask Josh to put on my socks because you know I can't go to bed without socks and I can't just be without socks. I want to see what he says and how he reacts. It's pretty f hopefully it'll be the reaction I think it'll be. Josh yeah will you put my socks on for me? Seriously? Please for my back. I guess. Oh, aren't you just kind? Now, you know I'm weird about my socks. Now, I told you I was weird about my sock. There, my hoop put your slippers back in for you. Yeah, because I'm the princess in this house. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, Josh. Hey, babe. Yeah. What did I just get us? You got us two tickets to the Four Crown National's Outdoor Speedway in September. Is that the best race of the year? Oh, by, by far, yeah. It's my favorite race of the year, the for Silver sure. Crown, Sprints. And midgets. midgets and I think they have maybe modifies 
Mod 5s. Or wing cars. Or wing cars. Yeah. I can't remember. They change it often. Yeah. But it's pretty fun. Yeah, it is. Especially it's... you see those midgets go around there. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, doggy. That's some sweet racing there. Yes, it is. Speaking of racing, we're watching racing from Pennsylvania, from Action Track USA. Now, this racetrack has a weird schedule because right behind them is a college. So they have to wait till they're out of school so they can start racing and then they end their season early when the kids, when the kids head back to school. Isn't that right, Josh? You always look at me funny when I'm talking. Oh, and Josh likes to make faces at me when I'm making my outro, so I have to go into a different room to do it because he'll laugh or he'll, like, repeat what I'm saying back to me. Yeah, that little stinker over there. So, update on Darling Girl. It's actually really good. Um, like I said, it's about post-Peter Pan. It's actually about Wendy's great granddaughter, and apparently Holly had twins with Peter Pan. I know that's crazy. Oh yeah, that's my heating pad. Cause I'm old from my back. But I was like, what? When I was reading it. So, I mean, I'm in far, but not that far. But I will let you know how it turns out. So far, it's pretty good. It's easy read, easy quick read. When I have time, I can read it. So yeah, that's the update on Darling Girl. Well, here we are again in front of my closet. It's Wednesday. Tomorrow it's going to be in the 80s. I have no idea what to wear. Do I wear a t-shirt? Do I wear a quarter link? Do I wear a kimono? Do I wear a long sleeve sweater? Like, this is what I deal with. And y'all wonder why I change my shirt three times in the morning. Because I would just lay something out and be like, ah, forget it. I'll, I'll, it'll be fine. Don't worry about it. And then... The morning comes, I put it on, I'm standing there looking in the mirror, I'm like, man, I, I don't, I don't like this at all. And then some days it's like, girlfriend, you don't have enough time, just wear what you got on and suck it up. So yeah, that's, that's what goes through my mind every single morning when I'm getting ready for work. Welcome to the crazy mind of Danielle. But looks like it'll do it for today. Thanks for hanging out with us. If you're new here, please stick around. We enjoy your company. And we hope you enjoy ours and this crazy thing we call life. Don't forget to like, subscribe. You can comment if you'd like. It'd be great to get some feedback. And I'll comment. Um, I'll comment. I'll link our socials in the description where I'm going to put my playlist I have. And I will catch you on the flippity flip. flip.